Here's how to make a cool text effect like this using CapCut for free on your phone. Open CapCut, start a new project, and bring in your video. I'm gonna use this video, now let's add some text to it. So click on text, and then type in whatever you like. I want the text to pop a little bit, so I'm gonna click on effects, and I'm gonna select this, and then change the color to pink. Now you have your video with your text. Once you're happy with it, click export. Open CapCut again and bring in your video as a new project. So this is the video we just created. Now click on that plus button and bring in the original video without the text on it. You're going to have one video with the text and then right next to it, the video without the text. Click on the second video and then click overlay. This would put this original video on the top layer. Now you're going to select that and then drag it to the first video. So it's going to look like this. Now to reveal what's underneath it, we're going to use the mask tool. So click on mask and then you're going to click on the split effect. So the very first one right there. We want this split to be vertical. So use both the fingers and then twist it around so it looks like this. Since she's moving from the left to the right hand side, what we're going to do is we're going to click on invert, click right there, and now you can see when you move it, it's only going to appear from left to right. Now depending on your video, find the time frame where you want that text to appear. Have it in that position, click the check mark. Now let's add a keyframe, so you're going to click on that diamond, and then go back to mask. And now, you're going to play the video and then you're going to move the mask to reveal the text very, very slowly. So, play the video, move the mask. And then play the video and then move the mask back again. This will take a little bit of time because it does take patience to get it just right. But I promise it's going to look great at the end of this video. And repeat the process and you're done. And this is what the final effect looks like. Once you're happy with it, click export and share it on TikTok or any other social media platform. Hope this is helpful.